Uh, this is something that I just couldn't believe when I first saw it yesterday. It has 7 million plus hits. It's these two Russian thrill seekers who did the unthinkable in Shanghai. Take a look at this. This is video that they posted basically showing you how to break into the construction zone for the Shanghai Tower, which once completed will be the world's second largest structure, man-made structure. So this is them breaking in to the tower, which is still under construction. They have a couple of backpacks. They're dressed in black. Obviously, it's illegal. And in this clip here, you see him sitting on the edge. That is about 1,200 feet up over the skies of Shanghai. And that wasn't enough. They actually spent the night, looks like, and started ascending the crane, which is at the very top of the tower. Mind you, it's still under construction once completed. This uh, structure is going to be 650 meters, so 2,073 feet. You know what you can really see there is how bad the pollution is. Right. Yeah. The pollution is bad. Yeah, look at He's standing on top of the crane. He's crazy. That's amazing. Isn't that unbelievable? Yeah, I mean, yeah, a slight is. little it's... wind gust oh, no, and you're no. gone. That's no. quite the risk. You know, if you watch oh, this video five. at home, it really it makes you nauseous. It's because scary. you get the same feeling of being up that high and getting nervous for them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they wow. did it. And these guys actually scaled the pyramids too in Egypt and did the same thing, posted a video and then later mm. apologized because people said that they were being insensitive to the history of those pyramids by, yeah. uh, by scaling the old line and ask for uh, forgiveness instead of permission. Mm -hmm. I do yeah. yeah, well, I Unless don't know what's happening in this case. Uh, I would right. imagine the Chinese authorities would really like to track down these uh, these Russian guys. Uh, so this is something that I wanted to pull just for Rob. Uh, <laughs> Rob does great weather. I love watching his weather. It's always creative, it's fun, he incorporates pictures, but he doesn't do any raps. And <laughs> <laughs> this if is you true. really want to venture really out, true. you can be like these guys with the Durham Academy weather team. Take a look. All right, stop, collaborate, and listen. Ice is back and the roads will glisten. Polar vortex has a hold of us tightly. Wind like a harpoon, daily and nightly. Will the power stop? No, I don't know. Turn up the heat and let go. Sleep falling down like a million missiles. Bringing school delays and early dismissals. Dance to the grocery store. What do you love think of that, Rob? That. Mm, maybe. I, I love that. And that's so cool, it even makes the U.S. sweater look good there. You know, I've seen some other rapping weather people. They're always good. There's something about people that like to do the weather, you like to perform. And uh, these guys certainly pulled it off. And the lyrics were good. The lyrics were Talking good. About the yeah. This storm. weekend, Rob's going to be writing out rap. Uh -oh. Join us go. Monday for News 10 at 9, a special rap forecast for you. The uh -oh. view is up next. Oh boy. Come on back for News 10 Midday. At Don't 11. get him started.